I want to fall in love at 85, go on shuffleboard dates, and dance to hip hop from 95. We'd rock matching tracksuits and rope gold chains. We'd look like Run DMC, but in their old age. We'd take aerobics classes and wear bifocal glasses and eat at IHOP and hold hands at Sunday masses. And when it comes to the bedroom, well, nothing much would happen in the bedroom because we're 85. But we would still be down to take a walk or take a drive or sit and talk or have a drink, watch the passers-by, ask each other why and how and who and where and when, and then we'd laugh and cry again about the people we had been. I would touch her withered skin and comment on how thin it is to keep in something infinite. And she would smile sweet and blush and tell me that I think too much. She's right, I think too much. It's always been a problem. But then again, that's how I made my green like the goblin. When I was in my 20s, I was eating top ramen, counting up my pennies saving up to go food shopping. But now I'm 85, and somehow I feel more alive. I turned my hearing aid up and bumped Jurassic 5. And when it comes to the bedroom, well, hopefully, every once in a while, she lets me knock her boots into the floral patterns of our bedpost, then hold her head close like death isn't chasing us planning on erasing us and replacing us with better versions of us, reshaping us, remaking us, then recreating us with new identities so we can make new memories. Hush, little baby. Learn to walk and talk and think and lie and feel and fight and love and die and never get the answers why. She dips a joint of grass in wheat grass and we get high. Her hair is silver as the moon in the Miami sky. We still pop hills but it's not the Xanax anymore. Whenever we can't sleep, we listen to the ocean floor. She got a sound of the C C D for me from the Brookstone store, and ever since I've been snoring like a... like a really good metaphor for snoring. Sorry, I go blank sometimes. What, I'm 85. I'm not complaining, I'm just happy that I'm still alive. And happy that I have my better half by my side, super fly, she doesn't look a day over 65. When I first saw her, I was totally in awe. She was classical, so I was like, yo, yo, ma. And that was all it took. A single look and I was shook. I fell for her like some loose shingles from our Spanish roof. And I'ma love her till she loses every last root and has to glue dentures to her gums to chew solid food. Ooh, now that's real love, dude. That's some push comes to shove love. Not when it's convenient, love. Hospital bed, love. Feed her ice chips, love. Never leave the room, love. Sleeping in the chair, love. Pray to up above, love. Have to pull the plug, love. Miss her in my bones, love. Everything about her love, die within a month, love, can't live without her love. Love, the only reason that we are alive, and none of us should have to wait until we're 85.